from Bear Grylls. Today, I'm with Steve Irwin. Crikey! We're, we're going to be entering the harsh terrain of Thomas Nelson High School. Alive. Finding whatever we can for food and water. This might be our only source all day. We don't know. Okay. We've got in. There wasn't a problem. We got ourselves a weapon too. But now, we got to find some food. Or else we're not going to make it tonight. Follow Thomas. us. Go, Bear, go! I think we found something that looks like right around here. Somewhere in there. It's right around here. Okay, you want that? Okay, good. Alright. Golden. Oh, this is a mistake. We must continue. Oh, we'll just keep going. It's gonna be cold. We're gonna need to find a place to sleep. Oh, that's why we need to sleep. Oh, true. We're gonna look in these caves. them because they get very cranky. Hey, you got Miss Thomas? Yeah. Miss Thomas here. I don't know what she's doing. I'm throwing away a donut box. She's throwing away a donut box. You heard it here from her. Keep oh. going. <laughs> then right here in your natural habitat, you got Andy Hughes. Yeah, I'm taking stuff to Mr. Merrifield. So yeah. What well, he said. And a balloon. And I, don't know they, I don't know. We, get, we got another one here. It's Wyatt. But then we got a Grant. Hey, Grant. Hey. You see him here? Come here. In our natural habitat. We're gonna support staff on our computer doing work. <laughs> Probably sending emails. Okay, let's move on. Lucky, we got a Mr. Webster here in his oh. natural habitat. We've successfully survived the harsh environment of Thomas Nelson High School. We only have a few minutes to make it to the effect point, so we've got to hurry. We observed today. Well, Bear, we observed some uh, lunch ladies. They prepare our meals for the students. That's how they care for us. We also met some pretty nice office people, like Miss Moore, Miss Mary. She, uh, she she keeps your attendance and makes sure you're at school. Uh, we met some people that had a lot sent them important emails. We also met the head, Mr. Webster. 